Hi guys, welcome back to my page. My name is Kanzina. Today we're going to do the matted look. Okay, today we're going to use the candle. I'm using the candle holder. They tell you to use the stove with, you know, pots and water and stuff, but I just find it to be convenient if you use the little candle burning holder thing. It's awesome. I got it for $2 at the store, Walmart, I believe. We're going to use beeswax. This was $2.99 at the hair store. Um, really nice little deal, actually. Um, I actually found this at Family Dollar. Now, I bought two of these. This one I'm not going to use because I have, like, all of these colors everywhere all over my bathroom. So, it's unnecessary. Um, it was so hard to pick that up with my nails. <laughs> I'm going to use this, um, nail filer because it just seemed to be convenient for me. Um, glossy lips. I got this for a dollar too, so it wasn't really, like, expensive or anything. Um, this I had in one of my other videos. This is for the smell. Uh, watermelon, my favorite. So, we're going to use that one today. And I also got these for like a dollar at the Dollar General. But yeah, we're not going to use that today. I just, you know, thought I'd mention the option. Now, this is my coconut oil. Me and my daughter, we made that from scratch. And oh my God, it came out so lovely. I'm going to do a tutorial on that as well too, but not right now. That is all I have left because she took hers with her. She's so wretched. <laughs> but um... This is what I'm using today. These are the ones that we're going to use. Um, right now, what I'm doing is I'm popping it out, guys. You have to pop them out because I just, I don't need the, the liner, the eyeliner. I just need what's in the bottom of this. I need the carrier. So I'm going to pop this out real quick, sit it to the side with the rest. All right, now I have it out, guys. I'm, I'm pointing to let you know that you need to clean it as much as you can. But if you can, it's fine. Um, once I took it out, I'm just going to put it inside a, a container it's just to hold it, to keep it away. I have like containers for days, guys. I'll just like stack this stuff up. You guys should see my bathroom. It's a mess. And not a bad mess. It's like a really good mess. Okay, now we're going back to put everything in this candle burner. So we're going to put about a half a tablespoon of care of coconut oil. Sorry, I'm thinking oils. All right, just put it in there. Then we're going to do the same with the beeswax. All right, we're going to pick out a color that we want. I was so indecisive about this because I loved all of them. But I chose that one because it was really pretty. And which for my first one, it came out to be really, really light. So when you guys do this, make sure that you're going to pick one that's, if it's this light, you have to add it with the darker kind of color just to bring that out. Which I should have did. I should have put like a gold in there. And that would have made it like pop on my lip. But I didn't. But you know. You live. You learn. Whatever. You move on. This was kind of messy guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm about to skip through this real quick. Okay. So I have it all in there. And I see you see all my stuff on the side of it. Um. So what I do. I just. It's like regular. Like if you have the the wax up there it's gonna burn it not burn it burn it but it's, it's gonna warm it up for you so I just light my candle put it on the bottom like the instructions tell you be careful guys this crap is hot okay it can get real hot all right let it warm up it literally has to warm up I completely forgot to put it on there so then I thought it was kind of warm, but not like completely warm because the beeswax took forever because I waited too long to put the candle in. But okay, I'm going to work it out, honey. We're going to work this thing out, okay? So 
so you mix it up really good guys and to me the consistent con consistency of it was not good enough so I put more um, glossy lip on it and kind of stir it up some because I, I just didn't like the way it came out it was like real chalky like it's real thicky and which this made it better and guys when you do make it make sure you use more of the lip gloss okay The color is really pretty to me. Like this is, it looked like it was going to be like bomb on my lip. It really did. I was really enjoying this. I was like, yes, yes, I'm going to love this. This is going to be fabulous, honey. Yeah, <laughs> you're going to see. But you mix it up really good, guys. Just keep mixing, mixing, mixing. Um, This is another one. I did it with a... Uh, the one I just had, I put the other half in there and I put like a purplish kind of because I realized it was not um, like popping. It wasn't like a, oh, notice me kind of look like, oh, look at me, girl. Yes, honey. It wasn't that. So I had to do another color in which I kind of went crazy with the color, guys. I apologize, but yeah. I just got like in the mood. It wasn't time for me to go pick up my baby. So, you know, I was just home. I was out of school. I was like, forget it. I'm just going to go in. So, yeah, you mix it up really, really good, guys. Mixing and I'm mixing and I'm mixing, mixing, mixing. It looks really pretty, don't it? Like, that is really, really pretty. And purple is like, ooh bomb that is like my color baby i love it so you see i done made like those yep yeah, those are like sets okay <laughs> i had so many it was so hot girl i had to go get this thing on you know the wand glove thing because that thing was hot baby so i figured out a way to put it on there you know because it's really really hot so i had to go get that so i won't burn myself um i took the candle out and i just you know dropped it on in there this thing was kind of messy for real for real. i wasn't really like prepared this is my first time ever really doing this so i had to yeah yeah girl get it together honey get it together okay i'm trying y'all <laughs> Maybe y'all will have a better, <laughs> a better way of doing this. Please teach me. But, you know, you live, you learn. It's whatever. Um, So, I just put them in there. You know, however I put them in there. I end up cleaning it up really nice. But it, it wasn't too much of a mess. So, it was all good. I tried to get as much as I could in there just to fill it up. But when I found, I really... When I start putting it on, it's like you don't really use that much of it. You just put it on your brush and you rub it on. Okay, guys, this is me um, making another one, but this one is kind of different. I'm not going to even lie. I'm still going to use the beeswax, you know, just a little bit of it. And it's about the same amount, but really it's, it's really up to you of how much you want how thick you want it to be how mad you want now this is the foundation i'm actually using this is a cool cool way of making this oh my goodness it comes out really sticking to your lips don't eat it please lower it it's nasty um i did it on accident don't judge my life okay but I also did the watermelon in this. I did it for everything because I, I want it all to smell good when it come when it get on my lip because it's too close to my nose to not smell good. But I was gonna use that, but then I looked at it and I thought about it. I was like, no, not a color I really want to do right now. They're all like real neutral, and I'm not really going for the neutral look right now. I mean, I love it, whatever, but yeah, yeah, no, not now. So, I was just looking for a color, and I was just like, where am I going to get it? 
BAM! This has been sitting in my closet for about two years now, y'all. Two years. It is time. Baby gotta use it, okay? So, I went for a brighter color. Isn't it fabulous? Yes. So, dug it out, you know, decided to use that. Now, as I'm deciding this, I'm like, you know, that's probably not going to be enough. Mm, let me use some more. Yeah. Okay, is that going to be, like, bright enough for me? I don't know. Yeah. Put a little oil in it. A little oil. Yeah. Everything need oil. Now, as you guys can see, it's, like, smoking. This time... I wasn't playing no games. I lit up that candle real quick because I want all of it to melt down at the same time. No lagging. All right, it's melted. I'm mixing and mixing and mixing. And it's coming out to be fabulous. Do you see this on my lips? Yes. It is a fabulous. Guys, just do it yourself. This in a store would cost me about six, seven bucks, depending on what it was. Now, this is a blue one that I made that you guys did not see. Um, I think I made it like maybe a week ago, but because I was messing with the other ones, I was like, you know, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make this. Um, but this actually, it wasn't a matted kind. This was a lip balm, guys. <laughs> I know it looks like it was, but it wasn't. So... I use the foundation. You can use that. Get a lighter tone of it. Dab it on your lips. And you make your own matted lipstick. Okay? Yeah, I wasn't going through all that. Yes, lip balm turned matted. Did that. Yes. So, I dabbed on. You can put as much as you want on here, really. I wanted it to be really thick because um, it's only supposed to be a lip balm. So, I mad it, mad it. You see how pretty that is? That is like lip balm material and turn matte. Like, did that. And these are like all the colors that I did. I didn't show you guys before, but these are all of them, okay? They are freaking gorgeous. Oh my god, I love all of it. Even the light one. I don't really care. But you guys, stay strong. Stay yourself. You know, don't do this for them, him. Only do it for you. If you enjoyed this, press like at the bottom down there, guys. Give me some thumbs up. I'm new to this. Help your girl out. All right. I'll see you next time on the next one I do. Bye.